Hey folks, I'm, I'm back and it's uh, more on the VCLT tip. I got some more VCLT, uh, but I also want to talk a little more about what I got yesterday. Um, I didn't uh, share everything. I'm playing the Volto again and um, this doesn't strike me as uh, experimental. I like experimental music. This has all been done before. Um, but I do want to show... Yeah, I have a. I, I pride myself in being an open-minded listener. I am definitely into experimental. This this Volto um, th doesn't strike me as experimental at all. This has all been done before. It's got a very nice etched third side, which I forgot to show you. Very nice, though. Thank you again, Mr. Trendkill, too. Yeah, I like Tool too. So this goes into uh, definitely. Uh, is an adjunct to the Tool collection. The guitar player, the Ziggler guy, um, um, he's a good player, but he's bore, boring, boring, boring to my ears. I'd, you know, I said it yesterday, I'd rather hear myself play guitar, but I really appreciate this. And yes, it is a nice limited edition package. Thank you, thank you. I wanted to get back to uh, so these records that I got yesterday from I think his name is Harold. Particularly, I want to talk about Angel Branduardi, and I'm going to play it because this turned out to be a pleasant surprise for me. I really like this album. And uh, I want to. Here we go. When I was younger, what I would do with records, because um, they were fascinating and I could only afford a few at a time, so I would just. I would take them par apart. I would like read, 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 read everything. And so yesterday, because Side 2 caught me, I played Side 2 again, and then I looked him up online. This album is pretty cool. Now, I see that it goes for nothing. It goes for a dollar or two in Europe. But there's this... This goes into my Prague collection. This is part of my Prague collection. This guy's a folk artist. He's still going. But, um... This qualifies as Prague in many ways. Um, the album, this is the um, English language version of this album, which was produced by Pete Sinfield. You Proggers know who Pete Sinfield is. He wrote the words for the first couple of King Crimson albums among and some other things. So um, I sh thought I'd show that. And then here's King Crimson making the connection to Angelo Branduardi, produced by Pete Sinfield. I looked also at the um, credits and uh, the keyboardist on here. Let me get it now. Gianni Nocenzi, is it? Yeah, the keyboardist from this album was the original keyboardist in the band Banco. So another Prague connection. One of the original members of Banco plays on the Branduardi. I just have a couple of Banco albums on vinyl, but I thought I'd show them to make the connection. Another uh, Banco album, Di Terra. Di Terra. Fantastic Italian band. So, um, Harold from, um, or is it, I can't read your name on the letter, but you sent me the VCLT from Germany yesterday. And this is a real prize. I'm real happy to have this in my collection. Angelo Branduardi, High Down Fair. I recommend it to uh, Prague listeners and well, just people that like good music. I'm playing it in the background. Really nice. I have my favorite cup that I usually use, but today I'm going to use the cup that Sabrina Joy sent me because um, she honored me again, you honored me again. Sabrina told me she was going to send me some music and it arrived yesterday. Really nice package. Just people are so kind. Thank you so much. Um, it really makes a difference. I really appreciate it, you know. Um, just appreciate it so much. Sabrina Joy sent me some... Um, apparently she was involved in a record label. And... Uh, let me see if I can say it right, <clears throat> because 
she sent me a note. But I'll use this too. Hyodakladar. 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 Was the name of their label. And um, really cool. She sent me this package. She sent me um, some records, but I'll show the cassette first. She sent this compilation cassette that they made, and it came in this box. Isn't that cool? Really nice. Comes in this box. Pop this baby open. I now had it open yesterday. Come on. I popped it open yesterday. It's got a yeah. There it is. It's got a cassette inside. And it's uh, fuzzy. Isn't that nice? Man, that's cool. I love cool packaging. Thinking of you, Tim Guthrie, too. And this is a compilation called Dress Up by Hyo, Hyo, Hyo Dokladar. <clears throat> and this is number 26 out of 35 that she sent me. I noticed among other people in here is Dino Felipe. I made a, I collaborated with Dino on a single few years ago so this came and also <clears throat> as part of the the package for the cassette um, comes this jacket man people are sending me clothes this is amazing and with the with the label um, name on the back I tried this on and it it does fit it's short in the sleeves of course because I'm, I'm long but I will I'll wear this Sabrina Wow Thank you so much. Wow. The gifts, the music, the gifts are just, they really do. It's a joy. I, I can't say enough how it's, an, it's, an, it's a dream come true to be living like this, to be interacting with folks like this, to be getting music from all around the world. It's a dream come true. And on top of that, Sabrina, you sent me some music. Thank you so much, some records. I just love records. And um, Sabrina sent me two albums by the Icelandic band Mum. I do like Mum, but this is my first vinyl. I will show that I had this three inch CD by Mum called Nightly Cares. Bought this one, it came out in 2004. Really neat package, it looks like a little book. A little three inch CD, but it looks like a book. So she sent me this on 10 inch, Mum, Finally We Are No One, a double 10 inch designed very similar to this. I love this band sound, um, tinkly, gentle, wonder-like, almost like wonder, the wonder of childhood comes to mind when some of this music, fantastic Sabrina. And I played um, most of this last night. I really like this band. And I love dropping the needle on records. I just love it. Nice, fat, 180 gram vinyl records. And she, you all, she also sent me a double album called Yesterday Was Dramatic, Today Is Okay by Mum, Icelandic band. Excellent. Really, thank you so much, so much, Sabrina. The VCLT really is a lifesaver, folks. It really is. Um, I appreciate it so much. And then she also sent me a bag of buttons and stickers. Now, what I want to remember to do is to pass some of these on. When my um, next orders come in, I'll put some of these in. Really appreciate it so much. And I, I just... I just want to say thank you, keep the videos kind of short so I can upload it and keep moving. Um, hopefully there'll be some news soon on the development of the new Derek record flyover. Um, I did get a <clears throat> message from the pressing plant expressing concern because this is a long record and it's going to be 25 minutes plus per side. But I know there's been records made that long. 
I can't afford to do a double album. So I'll find out with the test pressing how it sounds. They should be able to do it, you know. I was pulling Todd Rundgren's Initiation, and that album is over a half hour long each side, so I know they can do it. But we'll see what happens. Keep your fingers crossed for me. Thank you again, everyone. Thank you so much. You honor me. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs>